Hello everybody, welcome to the second part of my series where it's a throwing playthrough. Um, if you recall last time my game crashed. So hopefully nothing like that happens today. Real quick. Craft the table and put my piggy bank down. Seems I only have thrown stars right now. Let's see what let's see what armor I can craft. Can I only craft the helmets? That sucks. Okay. Just see what this can craft. Bronze enchantment. These enchantments get really easy to kill once you get into hard mode. Get once you get into hard mode, because um, you can just kill those bosses and get them. Now I'm just gonna. Build a house, more houses. What? Uh, the laundry. Not even a minute in, I already had to leave the recording for a minute. Shouldn't, shouldn't show in it, but if it does, then sorry. made me kill a freaking firefly. Why? It's just vibing. Yeah, y'all might wonder why I put that other channel in the description of my video. That's probably, that's, that's because that's the one my cousin, so might as well shout him out, but um, we might be playing some TF2 together. And and or SCP Secret Laboratory. He is uh, fun. He's also partly the reason why I started actually put doing videos. And I mean like actually doing videos, not just posting these weird videos like, uh, that are, that literally have nothing to do with anything. Where... I always wondered, what if you like, didn't have anything? What if, like... I kind of wanted to see if you could actually, you know, progress in the game if you just tossed away everything. Like, you didn't start with anything. Because I know that, uh, you, this dude sells the, um, copper pickaxe and the copper axe, but... What if you can't get the money to get it? Ten. I went that way last time. Did I go the other way? Not very far. Oh yeah, because I reached the crimson and died. Yeah, and this recording's only been going for a minute, so... Two. I'm glad I put that there. Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and place down a chest to put all my potions in. Actually, I'm gonna put that above this. Near the end, I probably won't even have to worry about the, um...
I won't have to worry about space for the... What did I eat? I don't know. I won't have to worry about space for any, like, crafting stations or anything. Because near the end, there's a thing that can pretty much combine, combines all of them into one. I'm still pretty sure that there's something wrong with the goblin army, goblin invasion, whatever, because whenever, um, it just does not show when it's supposed to, like, it would take way longer than it usually does. It's the one time I literally had been playing for, like, over three hours and never once got a single goblin invasion, but, um, as I was saying, bombs they can be used to craft this and this is uh, one of the um, infinite one well, I'm gonna take a real quick look at my controls Let's see here. Ability. Hmm. Throw smoke bomb, fireball dash, mutant bomb. I'm just looking for the thing that like, stealth strikes, like... Okay... This is the stuff that I don't really understand. Yeah, I don't really understand any of that, so... Looks like, ooh, yeah, so these are the rage mode and adrenaline mode thing. Oh, yeah, Rotten Eggs was the weapon that I had. Once I get throwing knives, I'll probably end up just saving them and get some poison knives. Being honest. I completely forgot that I'd like put on this alien suit. That one needs to have the arms dealer, bruh. Don't even need this dude. This dude I'd like, of course, uh, him, he's the dude that I want, let's see, summons a random bomb, I might just get that one for like, you know, exploding down a elevator, but I won't even need to do that, so. Let's see what the most expensive thing in the game is. Oh. Uh, um. Of 
close to me. This is the thing that I can't even equip. I equip this and it, and it breaks my game. I don't know why, it just does. And honestly, it makes me mad. Oh my god, there's an entire like yo-yo thing. I might do a yo-yo playthrough. That'd be fun. The... Well, this is like one of the most damage, highest damage you can do in the game. But it's so slow. Doesn't matter how much damage it does if it's slower than the moon. Whatever. Iron Tomahawk. This will probably... Actually, you get... Yeah, this will probably be the... No, because that's very fast. Once I get once I get the Goblin Tinker, though, I'll be able to buy these, and uh, then I'll no longer um, be using actual. Yeah, yeah, I'll no longer be using these because these, if you miss, they just land on the ground. So, and I can craft throwing knives with, with iron. I'll prop this. This is the thing. I'll probably um, craft these because then I can use the vicious or that. To craft the um, poison knives. No matter of fact, just what? Just wait until I get an extractinator, and then I'll really be making money because I found a exploit using the um, alchemist mod, alchemist and BC mod. It adds just a bunch of things that you can buy plants and potions and stuff from. And they, it also adds in an architect that you can buy stuff from. You can buy silt for like three copper, but then you put it through the extractinator, and then you get a bunch of like ores and all of that, and then you sell all of that for more than what you what you got. So, which yeah, it's like you can you can call it what you like, but I mean. I mean, I might not do it if y'all don't want me to, but i will probably still do it because it's one of the easiest ways to get money. I mean, of course, I gotta just farm bosses over and over. Or just buy, like, the 100 gold using the PP points. I literally, for some reason, this character kept on spawning with, like, a, like hundreds of them. So I ended up just going on to a different character and spending all of them on the gold on that character. So that it wasn't anything unfair for me. So I actually started off with out the hundreds of monies. I want to see what I can get from here. Aha! A nurse has arrived. Oh, well, I didn't even realize that I'd gotten. Oh, another thing that I can get is all I have to do is go to the. Um, all I have to do is go to the get make it to the beach, and then I'll be able to get the starfish, which are some decent throwing weapons. They're usually pretty. They're 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 usually they don't really do any damage because they're supposed to be like. I can't wait to get auto th th swing, but I need a zombie arm and a watch to do that because once you get that you can craft the um, the angry arm I think it's called or something like that and it automatically swings it gives you the ability to have auto swing and auto swing for like um, Throwing weapons is just being able to automatically, you know, throw them without clicking, 
like 5,000 times. Or if you had a melee weapon, you just, you know, it's auto swing, so it does exactly, you know, what the name says, auto swings. I'm not gonna get stuck here, just in case I have to run from something. You know, I wish I could just get a pyramid. That that would be nice. I've never actually gotten a pyramid in, at all. Like, in all the times that I've played, I've never gotten a pyramid, which is surprising, because they're supposed to be, like, not hard to get at all. I love how I'm just over here using the vanilla things, even though I have, like, mods and all that. And I mean, sometimes we know it's just better. It's gonna have to accept that. See, usually, out this is something that I wouldn't usually have, but it's 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 an exce I have plenty of accessory slots open at the moment, so might as well use it. Gonna just sit here and mine. Yeah, sorry, just paused it to see what we what time I was at. 16 minutes. This should be enough to. I'll probably stop this at like 25. And then record another episode like right after. And I died it. Right as I found iron that I was looking for. I really... You know, I once I get the architect, I know what I'm gonna craft. Once I get the architect, I'm gonna buy a bunch of cobwebs and turn it into cloth. And then use that cloth to craft some boots of speed because I am speed at least I will be if you kill okay so this is something that um, I found on my range character because of course range has a bunch of things that just attacks and attacks insanely fast but um since you usually will only end up doing one damage to it but uh the dungeon guardian drops an item that once it's equipped literally makes you shoot across the world at lightning speed which I'm surprised of course I die put all my valuables away oh I forgot I had iron already I need more Let's see here. I'm gonna come over here and look at boss summons. Oh, wait a second. This only shows the vanilla. Uh, I gotta look for the modded bosses. So, let's see here. Which desert scourge spawn info? The desert medallion. Yeah, see, this is the one that I wanna fight. Because it can give me a. Uh, now that I know what I'm, what I need, I'm gonna go get it. Hopefully, not die this time. Preferably. Oh, uh, no matter what, even after I've been playing for a little bit, my voice still gets all grouchy and weird. Probably because I'm not used to talking a lot because I usually just sit in my room and kind of excel myself. Or do this. All those people who like voice that like can do the voices make me jealous. But the best thing I can do is a pretty bad laugh of a 
SpongeBob. SpongeBob laugh. Get some vine rope. Might as well. And use it to finish off this. That's all. So first thing I need some cactus. I'm gonna go ahead and like just tab out of the map because I already know where I am and I don't like this being covered up. Tin cactus, some sand, and antler mandibles. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna come over here and just mine along. I feel like the desert is where I run into most of the um, worm, however you pronounce it, these things. Those type of enemies that drop the shards. I don't know if they're just supposed to spawn here more or what, but that's just what I seem to get. If I'm being honest, I might not beat every boss, but I'll do my best to beat as many as I can. Because there's some bosses that you can only fight at certain points in the game, and I might miss them, because of, you know. I've only played through these mods once, so I haven't, you know, been able to fight all of them. Like, I'm already about to fight the King Slime. Probably, I'll probably end up fighting that one before I, before I finish this, because after, because the King Slime dropped the solidifier, you can use the solidifier to, I know I have enough sand now, and enough, um, cactus, of course. No, I'm gonna... I really hope that thing doesn't fall down here. Especially while I can't see it. And done. Haha, get got, loser. Oof, that would that would have been bad if I hadn't if I had gotten got by that person. I don't want to die again, so do I actually did I already have another gold? Uh, looks like it's time to kill this thing. Getting what you deserve. It's mainly like stuff that gives you speed that that really helps me out most of the time. This 
second I'm able to mine these is when I'll finally get some pretty decent stuff. I won't say good, but I'll say decent. I don't think there's actually any like throwing weapons that these things can give me. So if there was, I'd gladly take it though. And that's my alarm. I'm gonna... Do I not have any? I don't have any recall potions. I thought I had some. You know, I probably put them in that chest whenever I was putting away my potions. That's probably what happened. And honestly, I'm not too surprised that I did that either. Because my brain is melon. It is literally melon. Like, it is melon. Like, green, light green stripes everywhere. But with that, um, I'm probably going to head back to the, to the house. And, uh, wait, I'm... I'm gonna end the video here again, probably this is just gonna be the end of the video. It's not gonna be like, have an outro or anything because I don't have one yet. When I get one I'll use it, but I don't have one yet, but um, my next video I'll probably start recording like right after this, but till then, see ya, and I'm about to head back to the house.